G'day guys, welcome to Yenar Beauty. My name is Tanya and I'm your personal little guinea pig. And today we're going to have a look at a couple of Jeffree Star liquid lips. Now, these guys are not new. I have with me Christmas Cookie and Calabasas. And while I know that there are a lot of videos about these liquid lipsticks, um, I haven't quite come across one where they combine the two and put them on the lips. Pretty much because I want to kickstart my um, food versus uh, lipstick videos, I thought I better, I better get this and get this video out of the way and get it done and show you guys. And then we can make a start on that. Um, if you guys are interested to see, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do uh, swatches on the arm of both of these. Um, I'd like to do lip swatches as well. Hopefully I can actually have enough battery time to do that because I'm looking, I'm looking like halfway. And then I want to mix Christmas cookie and calabasas together, swatch it on my arm, also put it on my lips for you guys to see. And um, yeah. Hopefully this turns out well. If I look like a mess, I am sorry. The, I just didn't want to waste this makeup. I have been out to see with my three-year-old the uh, Dino Mania, you know, like the big puppet. Uh, what do you want to call that? Like, they weren't robotic dinosaurs, but like massive um, human puppets, I guess. And um, yeah, good time. Anyway, um, if you're interested in seeing more, you want to see me wear these and try these on, and uh, hmm, stay tuned. Alright guys, so let's get started. Now I don't normally use wipes on the face, um, but just for this video, I thought it would be easier, especially because once these guys dry down, mm, they are impossible to get off. So, that's pretty much it. Now, I'm going to start with the lightest shade first. Just remember guys, always give these a really, really, really good shake. Um, what I am going to do before I apply these is, ordinarily I would have expo exfoliated the lips, but um, I haven't done that today. My lips aren't too bad. They are usually pretty dry, but I am just going to grab, what is this? This is my Nivea Repair and Protection Lip Balm. I am just going to like dab this on. I don't want too much. I just want to have just a little barrier and I find that it sits better anyway and like I said give this a shake this one here is um, Christmas cookie all right I love the applicator on these guys seems to put the product on perfectly but in saying that me and liquid lips swear we're still not best buddies yet I still I still make accidents so let's put this one right here Let's make it a good one though. Because I want to put them all side by side. Alright, so let's get this on. I love this colour because I feel like I could wear this almost anywhere, anytime. It doesn't, uh, on me anyway, doesn't really give me that butthole look that um, some, you know, lighter shades can do. I love this colour. Um, so that's what this one looks like. Alright, so now let's take this off before it sets too much. And like I said, once they do set down, they are so hard to get off. Alright, time to put the next one on. Now my lips are just a little bit tinted, but since Calabasas is a little bit pinky anyway, I don't think it really matters that much. Alright, once again, like I said, give it a good old shake. These also don't smell like anything fruity or anything, guys. Both of these, they sort of just smell like paint. Um, I'm not really that mad about it. Let's give this one a good old swatch next to Christmas Cookie. Isn't that beautiful? I absolutely love Calabasas. 
and actually I was having a real hard time because I wanted to get Calabasas but I also wanted to get Androgyny and I, I couldn't figure out which one I wanted more. I ended up obviously going with Calabasas but I still want to get Androgyny. So let's put this one on. I find this one a little bit harder. Um, I'm just going to put the lip balm on again. So... I will get androgyny and then I'll try mixing all these ones as well. So let's get this one on. I'm probably going to make a lot more mistakes with this one. I, I always tend to, so mm, let's go. Guys, how beautiful is this colour? I mean, look, I don't know whether I can really pull this colour off or do it any justice, but I freaking love this colour. I, oh, God. It's like, right now, for in, when I'm looking in my own mirror, it's like this raspberry, I don't know, like a, a it, I just love it. I love this colour. Um, yeah, obviously probably doesn't go with this eye look either, but... <sighs> I love this, and this is Calabasas. Alright, let's get this one off. Because this one, this one's going to be harder to get off. Alright, so the next one. I am going to combine uh, Christmas cookie and Calabasas, and we're going to see how that goes, alright? So, I'm just going to mix equal portion of... Christmas cookie in a dish and calabasas, equal parts of that beside it. Okay, we're going to mix them together. Now, I already know what this looks like because I've already tried it myself. And to be honest with you, it, it's, it's not that much different. Um, I'm going to put it on the lips first before... I do a swatch because I don't want it to dry out before I'm finished. So, there we go, guys. Da da. Now, like I said, oh, what I, what I'll do is is I'll. I'll run my finger and I'll do that swatch. Now it's going to be obviously a fatter one because I'm not using this stick. But we will put that right here. So there you go. As you can see, there's not a lot of difference. Mm. I still love it. Um, it reminds me of the Maybelline Lover, but I think I like the Jeffree Star formula better than I do the Maybelline um, Ink, Superstay Ink, or whatever it is. Um, but yeah, guys, that's what these two look like on. So anyway, guys, that's pretty much it. Um, that's probably the reason why there hasn't been a video of the Christmas cookie and calabasas is because the colour isn't that much different. But you know what, I feel I still feel like that there needed to be one. Um, I still love this colour. Guys, if you're a little bit on the fence about whether or not you want to invest into Jeffree Star, because I mean, obviously you can't just like, in my town, you can't just go down the road and pick it up. You have to order it online. Um, I paid, I think it was $18 for each of these, but... When you're in a town like mine, drugstore, you, you can still pay $20, $30 for a Maybelline or a Revlon or a L'Oreal lipstick or something like that. So when we talk about drugstore in Australia, not everything is cheap. Okay, we do have a lot of sales in our pharmacies or drugstores or whatever, but $18 for a liquid lip that lasts the way that it does is definitely worth it. And if you're not 100% sure if you're going to love the colour, the beauty about these guys are is that they're completely eye safe. So if you want to, you can put these all over your face. You can use them as um, eyeliner in the water, uh, in the waterline. You can use them as eyeshadow. Just blend them out, or just have them full strength on your eyelids. It doesn't really matter. Um, 
Now, there's so many different things that you can do with these guys and if you need some inspiration there are tons of videos online of people mixing them all together using them as liners using them as as complete eyeshadows or just um, makeup art you know there are so many different things that you can do with these guys so it's definitely worth it don't be afraid if you want to try some and you're not 100 percent sure go with some safe colors that's what i did to start off with i love the formula i'm definitely going to get some more um but yeah, guys, if you liked what you saw, feel free, go ahead, give me a thumbs up. It helps me know whether or not I should continue making these types of videos. Same goes with a thumbs down if you didn't like what you saw. But if you do give me a thumbs down, please let me know in the comments down below respectively why. That way I can know and I can fix it or I can become better at what I do. And um, because I enjoy making these videos, not just for myself, but also for you guys as well. So you guys can either get a bargain or find out what you're buying before you actually buy it from somebody else's perspective. And if you aren't part of the team yet, I would love to have you we just passed 100 subscribers the other day and i'm absolutely wrapped and i want to thank you all for your support i never thought that i would get 50 let alone 100 um if you're not part of the crew and you want to be part of the crew i upload at least once a week or i'm trying to um sometimes i get up two videos in the fortnight not quite once every single week but um go ahead click that subscribe button but don't forget to check the bell that way you can be notified of all of my upcoming videos and um i look forward to seeing you guys in the future Thank you so much. If you need my socials, they're up here somewhere. So, yeah. Look forward to seeing you in my next video, guys. Bye.